Hi everyone, it's Lynn here, Bead Fairy One. Um, I've just got a short video for you of a project that I've done. Um, sorry about the siren in the background. It always happens when you start videoing, doesn't it? Um, I saw a, a project that Miss Garden Grove One done. Um, it was a while back. It was a, a chair that she'd done, and um, I thought it was lovely. And she sort of inspired me. <sighs> now I can't start it up. Sorry about this. Uh, everything happens when you try to film. Um, so yeah, I hunted everywhere for a chair, and in the end, I found one on eBay. Um, I have got a picture of it, what it looked like before, and I'm going to try and upload it onto the end of this video, but um, I'm not quite sure. But anyway, I will tell you, it was like a black, blue, like squidgy leatherette chair, and it had a hole in the seat where you could put a beer bottle. So, um, and this is what I've done with it. So, I'm just going to... It's very, it's quite big, so I'm going to have to go back a bit. Right, I hope you can see this. Um, I've actually covered it. First of all, I covered it in this sort of like stretchy uh, material that I just stuck all over the chair for something to, for it to adhere to. And then I covered it in this sort of like uh, really shabby, chic material. And... Um, I'm just going to go in closer now to bits of it. Uh, around the bottom, I've put this like um, trim that I got off um, eBay, um, and this uh, this trim round here, I got when I was in America last year, and um, some flowers here. Um, that some are wild orchid crafts and some are what Angela um, seventy thirty gave me as a gift. Um, the doily at the back came from I went oh, I went to um, the new new forest show and there was an, an antiques tent and I went in there and bought um, lots of doilies off of a lady and she gave me them all for five pound and I was absolutely over the moon. So that's um, that's that part, and then I made um, like a little cushion out of my um, my crochet doilies. So I've made like a little pillow, and then um, put put them two to together, and then I've made them into a little pin cushion, and they've got all my my pins on. So um, I hope you can see this because it is quite big. It's not that big actually. It's um, about six, seven inches square, I'd say. But um, and on the feet, I just put some, um, you know, like those glass pebbles that you can get. I just put um, four of those on the feet because the actual bottom wasn't. There was nothing on the bottom. It was all squidgy. So. Um, there was nothing to adhere anything to, so it it had to be something that I could stick down. So um, that's my little chair, and I'm really chuffed with with how it came out. And um, I'm going to be doing. I've got some uh, cups. That I'm going to do be doing some pin cushions in. I've also got a couple of um, like unusual um, shaped jars and. Um, I don't know what you'd call it. Um, it's like a vase type thing. So watch this space. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that one yet, but um, I'm sure I'll come up with something. So that's it for now. I'm going to be back in a minute. I've got a little um, video to do of my swaps with UK and Ireland, um, embellishment swap from Katie. And I've got another video to do uh, explaining about um, the crochet doilies. I've had a couple of um inquiries so um see you soon bye